<laughs> okay, Captain Underpants, relax. Why am I blushing? I hate this. <laughs> no. Why am I like this? The video hasn't even started. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Stop. What is going on with me today? <laughs> Alright, so hey so guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, by the title, we are doing another episode. Guys, this series is actually addicting. I'm obsessed with it. It's so good. Um, the last episode, there was a lot that happened. <laughs> we, we have to get a job. We have to get a J-O-B. So that's what's going on. Um, let's just jump into today's video, see what's going to happen, see what's popping, all that. I'm going to stop rambling. So let's just jump into today's chapter. Okay. There's a new one called Mafia Princess? Hold up. No. Distraction. Okay, anyways. So are you back to being a runway model again? <laughs> of course. <laughs> uh, girl does not look like she's ready. None of the fashion houses will take me. Yeah, I wonder why. Like, what does my modeling career have to do with my parents? It's all about image, sis. <laughs> and right now your image <laughs> is crippling. I'm sorry. Sorry to hear that, Sabrina. Thanks, but what do I do now? The same thing the rest of us do. Keep moving. I'm sure something will come your way. He's so positive. I love it. Okay. Well, anyways. Oh, you can help him work on cars. <laughs> Scott, why can't I work with you? Because <laughs> you'll be just like a complete distraction. <laughs> you want to fix cars with me? Of course. I know how to pull a wrench. I mean, I could be your assistant or something. I doubt it. <laughs> First of all, that's rude. Second of all, don't doubt us. You think I can't learn how to fix this stupid piece of junk? I She's actually rude. I think it's easier than it looks. It's not. This isn't the 1950s. I could be better than you. Um, this isn't the 1950s. We're just, because the other ones are just, no. This isn't the 1950s. Women can do anything. Period, sis. Go off, queen. And what do you know about cars? <laughs> I don't know, Sabrina. What do you know about cars? What do I need to know? I won't have time to teach you everything from scratch. Then what should I do? I only know how to walk on runways wearing fancy clothes. That's your problem, princess. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> it is our problem. I know that. <laughs> you set my kitchen on fire. Now I have to pay extra money for food delivery. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But that was your fault too, okay? You distracted us. We distracted each other. It was just one small fire. Princess, you came to my house from out of nowhere and almost burned it down. The least you can do is help me repay for a kitchen. It was your fault too, you know. How was it my fault? Like I just said, distracted. You were too busy oogling me and didn't notice a fire. That was what? Scott, just admit it. You got distracted. Like I said, guys, I just, I should write this. I know what they're gonna say. You got distracted. You got distracted too. Stop blaming me. It's not my fault I'm hot. Okay. I mean, at least she's got confidence, right? Okay. Sure. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Admit it, you wish you kissed me that night. Mm. <laughs> Girl, we need to stop this right now. <laughs> well, that was your last damn chance, Bradshaw. Oh, really? Suddenly, Scott pressed me against the head of the car. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That went from zero to 100 real quick. Sir, I'm gonna need you to scoot a little bit back. <laughs> what? What are you doing? I think I'm not the only one here who wants to kiss. I think you're scared of me. I think you're playing me. I, uh, don't do this to me, Scotty. I think you're playing me though. Like, this is a fun game to you. Well, it's not a game to me. I think you're playing me, but it's not gonna work, Scott. He looked at me with a rebellious look in his eyes. Get your hands off of me, okay? We're not playing this game of cat and mouse. No! He slightly opened his mouth to say something, but stopped himself. The tension in the air was thick between us. I was breathless. Oh, guys, they have sexual tension. <laughs> We're two magnets that want to touch each other so badly, but something in us wasn't giving up any ground. I never thought I would miss the feeling of being with someone, but Scott changed that for me. Ah, uh, the way that her feelings are coming into play already is kind of concerning because it's only been like two days. I clenched my hands into fists to fight with an urge to get any closer to him. And I took a deep breath. See? I think we both know what we want, Scott. Why don't you show me that? Um, uh, no. No. No, no, no. I think you want to kiss me right now, Sabrina. Flirt and drive him wild, shut him down, reject him? I mean, if we reject him, that might 
want make him want us more, you know? But also, if we flirt with him, he'll be like, oh, she's spicy. Do we want her, you know? So, I think I'm spending the coin. I'm spending, I'm spending the coin. I'm not going to. Not because I can't. You just haven't shown me you deserve it yet. Scott raised his eyebrows. He wasn't expecting me to flirt back like this. You want it? You have to earn it. Period. We know our worth. I don't, well, kind of. Because her last man was very, um, debate debatable. Yeah, so, anyways. And your bad boy routine isn't gonna work on me. Scott leaned closer to me. You know what I see? A woman with a huge crush who's never had a guy challenge her before. The woman was too stunned to speak. <laughs> no. No. Why am I blushing? I hate this. Scott pulled me in closer to him. So you admit, you wanna kiss me, Scotty? I... That's what we thought. Why else would you be here with me? Touching me. I see how you look at me when I walk out of the bathroom in a towel. <laughs> <laughs> you pretend to be oblivious, but inside you're burning. You keep talking about how you let me live here, but deep down, you love that I'm here. She's really playing this game. Okay. You want me here? Yeah. 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 <laughs> he has feelings for us. She's right. I want her so badly. Yeah, well, you can't have it. Okay. Oh, wow. I feel that tension even right now, Sabrina. You really like him? Wait, did she tell them the- Oh, did, wait, did she tell them the truth that they're not actually dating or like what? Why don't you just go for it? Just go for it? He's playing hard to get with me. He's not like any guys I've met. He flirts just to get his way. Um, he's just not like any other guys we've met. Because we're used to preppy guys. Right? Right, yeah. Scott is different than all the guys that I know. Really? Well, everybody around thinks you two are dating. So just make those rumors a reality. It's obvious you like him. Scott is sexy as hell. I wish he was gay. <laughs> Don't lose your chance. If you two tease each other too much, someone else is bound to swoop in and snatch him. I don't know. He's been single all this time, so I don't think that's gonna happen. Pam is right. Me and Conrad just broke up. Wouldn't this be moving on too quickly? No. Conrad's a scumbag. He's disgusting, so... No. Oh, shit. What? You haven't heard the news. What news? Conrad is dating Cynthia Myers? You've got to be kidding me. We're not mad. We're not mad. We're fine. We're fine. What? Sorry. Sorry. You are not at a party, young lady. Okay, I'm so sorry, lady. Okay, we're in a crisis right now. You are at the sacred temple of knowledge. How about you knowledge yourself somewhere else? Okay. My arch enemy? Are you talking about Cynthia or Mrs. Pasternak? Wait. Conrad couldn't stand Cynthia and her family. Uh, that's not what their epigram looks like. What are you talking about? What the heck? Could this day get any worse? Yeah, but don't jinx yourself. Yeah, that really sucks. But now you can chase Scott guilt-free, trust me. We were gonna chase him- well, actually, we don't chase, okay? Anyways, it was gonna be guilt-free any- any- it was gonna be guilt-free either way, so. I guess you're right, moving on is hard. It is not hard! Not when you were dating Conrad, please. I guess you're right. Conrad was the only guy I've ever dated, and that was a mistake. Damn it. Hold on. Conrad and Cynthia are throwing a luxury party tonight, and? And they are hiring serving staff and I happen to need a job. Girl, no, not you crashing a party. You wanna do what? It's no big deal. My ex is dating my enemy and I wanna make him regret it. You really think that you being a waitress at his party will make him feel bad? Probably not. He's probably gonna think we're dirt, but it's fine. <laughs> is this your first time doing a revenge plan? I have a plan. Oh God, what do you have on your mind? Let's just say those two are both going to regret their decision. By the way, you're gonna need a suit because you're coming with us because we drag you in all of our problems. Sabrina, I don't fit in here at all. Yes, you do. Just smile and look pretty and you'll be fine. Stop calling me by my name. We're not supposed to know each other. Cupcake, what's your plan? Don't need to worry about it. Go have fun. Go make some rich friends. Maybe they'll invest in your company. Hey. Ew, is that her? Oh, yeah. She's even wearing my dress for my birthday this year. Have you heard? Ew, everyone's so fake. Like, all of our friends. It's like an entourage of fake-ass people. Sabrina is barely making the ends meet, and you guys didn't help at all. I'm not surprised. Look at her parents. I mean, what did she hope for? Guys, you could at least have a little bit of dignity. We can't make fun of people in need. You're actually disrespectful and rude. I can't stand y'all. Sabrina was our friend. A friend? All she did was brag about her stuff. Her fashion style wasn't even that good. Okay, Jack Frost, relax. <laughs> oh, shut up. You are all jealous of her. Oh, period. Hannah, you're my girl. You're my girl, period. As if you aren't. I miss her. Yeah, 
Hannah is actually my friend. Y'all are fake bitches. Did she come to you begging for help too? Oh yeah, she did. And you declined us. I'm just kidding. You're actually fake too. So Hannah, you're on, you're on my list. My bad list. My parents banned seeing Sabrina. They're scared of what we would be accused of being accomplices. Well, I just never liked her. Well, no one asked you, Richie, okay? She got what she deserved. Wow. DuPont suck. What a great toast. Down with Sabrina, up with Cynthia. She's even worse than us, so have fun with that. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I just found out that none of my friends were honest with me. Makes me wonder whether I had friends at all. You didn't. Sorry to break it to you. Sabrina. Oh, Conrad and Cynthia. Sabrina, you're better than this. No, we're not. <laughs> you don't understand. I'm not asking you to help me. And you have no idea what it's like to be in my shoes. So don't lecture me on morality, Scott. Champagne? Finally. Okay. Have fun. I hope there's x in your drink so you shit all night. <laughs> Mr. Hale? Uh-huh. A little bit of this won't hurt you. Now it's time to change this ugly uniform. I need to look sexy and unrecognizable at the same time. What are we wearing? Oh, that one's... Okay. Oh, the blue dress. Okay. I... What is this? What... No. Okay, we're wearing the blue one. I'm... Yes, go off. <laughs> Hannah? Sabrina? Oh wow, your dress is breathtaking. What are you even doing here? Didn't expect to see me? No, not really. Why? Because I'm in need? You heard us? Yep, every single word. Well, not every single word, but the stuff, the bad stuff you guys were saying. You didn't even notice me. Sabrina, I'm so sorry. You were my best friend, my only friend, and I thought you'd always have my back. Are you kidding me? I do have your back. Well, you could have fooled me, but uh, whatever. Sabrina, you can't be here. Get out. What? Why can't we be here? What is she talking about? Quick, there's not much time and we can't let anyone know we're talking. You need to hear me out, Sabrina. I found something out about your parents that you need to know. Hannah was always a good friend to me. She was not like the others. I want to trust her. I need to know who's trying to destroy my family. And Hannah could be a valuable ally in the future. This could save your whole family. Find out about the burning secrets, reject her, and stay in the dark. No, no, we have to help our family because I feel like someone set our parents up. I bet it was Conrad and that Cynthia bitch or one of our fake ass friends. I will not give you any money. Where? Why is she screaming at us? The feds are spying on all of us. That's why I couldn't reach out to you. Uh, because y'all are guilty too, probably. Sabrina, somebody set your parents up. I'm telling y'all. But you were my friend. Well, of course. But who? I don't know. Somebody who hated you the most. That's a very long list. That's what makes it even harder. But I hired a private detective. I'll keep you updated if I find anything. Unbelievable. Well, that is how you repay me for all my kindness? You know I've always been there for you and I always will. You are so deceitful. I don't know who to believe anymore. I hate you, DuPont. Oh, they're like playing. They're like making people think. I got it. I'm actually dumb. That took me a minute to realize that they're like fake. They're like whispering. Anyways, I found out the day before your parents' arrest, somebody forged your numbers into accounting. You rat! Sorry. The numbers were obviously fake, but nobody even dared to double check. We are not friends. I never liked you in the first place, DuPont. They were waiting for the perfect opportunity to take you and your family out. Oh, oh, not her slapping her. I think that was so unnecessary. I don't want to see your stupid face anymore. Sorry. How dare you? Some very influential people want you out of the picture. And who knows what they plan to do with you. I don't want to be anywhere near you, psycho. Don't trust anybody. We don't know who is in on this. But give me some time. I'll do everything to get to the bottom of this. We are in it together. So what do I do now? You need to stay low. You never learn. No scandals. Just be careful. Please. Thank you, Hannah. Leave me alone. We have nothing to talk about. Okay. Okay, well, Hannah has our back. I was actually worried for a second there. I was confused for a hot minute what was going on. I figured it out. I'm a little... I, it took me a while to process that. Who could possibly hit us so much? A lot of people. We helped so many people. Who would want to destroy our family? Well, is he okay? Whoa. You look, oh, cause he changed. Hi. <laughs> Not like a waitress anymore? You look hot. Sir, <laughs> what? <laughs> Thanks. Love this sexy stranger idea. Oh, now you like our idea. Hmm. I see you're playing your role well. Pretending to be rich is easy. Ladies and gentlemen, I am so happy to see everyone present here. I know we are all busy people. What's so funny? These people haven't worked a day in their life. We would like to make a toast. Me and my dear Cynthia are celebrating our first month together. Month? Oh, wait. <laughs> wait a damn minute. You've been cheating on us? You've been... He's been cheating on- of course he's been cheating on us. I'm not even surprised at this point. <laughs> I couldn't be happier. Oh no, poor girl. Cynthia being with you shows me that true love exists? Huh? 
Oh, he's actually full of shit. <laughs> he told me she looked like a badger. I kind of see it, right? My dear Cynthia. Ew. <laughs> Bitch, no. No, he is not, dude. No. Will you make me the happiest man alive and marry me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? We were together. Wow. Wow. Okay. Ooh, okay. That's his great grandmother's ring. He told me he never wanted to marry anyone. Well, he lied to you about multiple things. So, yeah. Oh my god, that ring is wonderful. I. Is she okay? Ew! <laughs> she just puked on him! <laughs> oh my god. I love Sabrina. <laughs> I need to go to the bathroom. Get out of my way. Ew. Ew, that's so nasty. No, my proposal! Stop filming me! Ew, 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 that's nasty. <laughs> Your work, they'll be fine. Just a few upset tummies from their drinks. I know how to get revenge without sending someone to the hospital. You are evil. Thank you. Now everybody will be talking about their engagement. It will be one to remember forever. Pukey and puker. Yeah, but not the way they wanted. I don't know if I approve, but seeing the side of you is hot as hell. Hey, <laughs> I'm not done yet. Wait for me in the hall. Whoever it is, leave. That was epic, Conrad. What the? Sabrina? Nice suit. At least it was a nice suit. What are you doing? Just giving you what you truly deserve, Toilet King. Funny how once I stopped having money, you stopped wanting to date me. And Cynthia, you two deserve each other. You will pay for this. By the way, if I find out you somehow involved in my parents' arrest, you'll wish I went as easy on you as I did tonight. What do you want? Sabrina? Uh, what is that? Give me back my pants. Not her stealing his pants. Have fun walking out there naked. Uh, girl, bye. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm not. What do you mean? Excuse me, huh? What do you mean? What do you mean? I think I know one more way to get back at your nasty eggs. <laughs> when he's evil with you? This is great. And what is it? Uh, VIP. That's his royal sweet key. Oh my god. Where did you get it? Let's say he actually lost it on the way to his throne. What should we do? To ruin his suite? Think bigger. We'll order every possible expensive service and let Conrad pay. The room is in his name anyway. You are an evil genius. I'm so down for this. We could have some fun too, you know. What kind of fun? <laughs> oh yeah, what kind of fun? Let's see where the night takes us. Let's do it. Just the two of us. Let's make tonight something special. Spend a steamy night in the royal suite. Back down and call it a night. <laughs> You guys don't know me well enough. Of course, I'm going to spend the coin and I'm staying in the room with Scotty Boo Boo. So let's do that. To the royal suite. Oh my god, they really did go all out. Even air in this room is richer. It is La Plaza, Scott. They sweep the floors with golden brooms. So what should we do first? We should hit the sauna, skincare treatment, get massages. Oh! Let's get massages. <laughs> get massages. My back isn't used to cheap mattresses. Let's do it. Wow, couples massages. <laughs> Don't they usually have towels on the bottom half? Okay. I feel so refreshed. Me too. I have one more idea. What is it? How about we try that honeymoon package? Okay, I'm down. <laughs> I mean, we're both already naked. Um, sir. What do you mean? Just follow me. What? What are we doing? I'm so confused. Ta-da! Oh. <laughs> he wants us to go in the hot tub naked together? <laughs> okay. Okay. Only the best for us. Oh, wow. Come on. Uh, okay. Join me. Do I have to pay for this? Do I have to pay for this? Let's see the bikinis. Okay, we have number one. That one's cute. Let's see. Got number two. Just like a... That's like a weird top. Anyways, let's do the third one. Okay, we're gonna go with the first one. I like number one. Let's do that. Okay. You know, I've done a lot of crazy shit with my friends, but to break into somebody's suite, that's something new. I feel like a rebel. Technically, we didn't break in. We had a key. True. So is this what your life was like before? All this luxury? Yeah. Party, scandals, high-end fashion looks, and a lot of champagne. Just a regular Thursday for me. And a sexy guy in a hot tub with you? Maybe jealous? Oh. Jealous? And who said you were sexy? No one said that. I, but I'm just gonna say jealous. Jealous? Relax. I'm here with you after all. Yeah, I feel so privileged. Oh, you should. You are so goddamn gorgeous. Scotty, don't play with my heart like this. One compliment and I'm disarmed. <laughs> Scott, I know I'm not good enough for you. What? Don't talk about yourself like this. Oh my god, guys, I'm actually in love with him. Don't do this. But you should know. 
You were right. I did want to kiss you back then. And what about now? Scott moved to me and his hand cut my face. His thumb brushed my lower lip. I might bite. Scott smiled in response. Are they gonna kiss? Wait, what? His hand went down my neck, making me feel even more hot. My body was burning for him. Guys, okay, are you gonna kiss or not? So I moved closer to him and wrapped my arms around his neck, pressing my body to his. This is so bad. I know. Scott left a short but hot kiss on my neck right below my ear, and he moved to my collarbone. <laughs> and they're naked. Well, I, I guess not, because she's wearing a bathing suit. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, guys, okay, I'm getting uncomfy. Oh, Scott, ew. Okay, that, that did it for me. That's it. His hand squeezed my waist and pulled me closer to him. Scott's skin felt absolutely silky to me. Just kiss me already. His head moved so close to mine. Scott's lips slightly touched mine. <laughs> Guys! Scott, close your eyes. Okay. Why? Trust me. As I closed my eyes, he cut my face and I felt his lips dress like brush against mine. My heart skipped to be guys <laughs> he's amazing shivers ran down my spine we couldn't get enough of each other guys they've only known each other for a couple days i'm like this is happening already what i ran my fingers through his hair i want you sabrina okay slow your roll buddy we're not there yet okay just when i was about to heat up someone walked in some what is that somebody's calling us what huh what it's coming from the room service phone mr hale we have received your security request about sabrina depart he put a security search out for us? No. We're looking for her right now. We will notify you when we find her. We better run. We have to get out. Immediately. You guys better run. We can't let them catch us. His family will destroy us. Uh, whose bike is that? Is he gonna steal on a bike too? I've got an idea. Let's grab that motorcycle. They'll never catch us. Oh, we're just stealing a lot of things tonight. Guys, we're gonna go to jail. Stealing? Are you out of your mind? Why do you care? It's Conrad's bike. It is? Yep, I saw him get off it earlier tonight. Then we should definitely take it. This is our only way not to get caught. Sir, I think I spotted her. No, you didn't. Let's go, Sabrina. Romantic escape on the motorcycle. Run and risk getting caught. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not getting caught. We're not going to jail. We're gonna take the motorcycle. Sorry. That's also a... um. Yeah, it's fine. That's also not good, but it's fine. Fine, but only because we're desperate. Of course. Let's go, guys. Okay, stop looking on it and get on. Hop on and hold tight. You stole my pants. <laughs> okay, Captain Underpants, relax. My bike, come back. What are you staring at, idiot? You're the one who looks like the idiot, Conrad. <laughs> Follow her. Yeah, okay. You hoo Ew, imagine if someone said that. That's an ick right there. Can you slow down? You want those bouncers to catch us or what? I think they lost us. Phew. What were we thinking? Oh, come on. You have to admit, it was a little fun. Okay, yeah, it was. Okay, but how are y'all gonna get the bike back to Conrad? Like, he's gonna say that you stole it. Are you okay? Not really. Wanna share with me? Share what? Oh, don't trust anybody. You don't know who is onto you. But do you really think Scotty Boo Boo would do that to us? No, he can't. He can't. What if he is a fed though? Imagine. Oh my god. No, I can't deal with this. No, it's just Conrad and Cynthia's engagement. Still hurts. I can only imagine. Love sucks. Let's go home. I'm exhausted. It was a wild day. Sabrina, wait. What? Uh, oh. He said another kiss? Okay. Scott pulled me by the waist and locked our lips in a kiss. Yeah, he really likes us. Okay. It was sudden. It was passionate. It was magical. What? What was that? Let's head home. He's just gonna pretend like nothing happened? Okay. You coming? Or you want me to leave without you? You would never leave without us. Let's be realistic. Ew. What are we wearing? Happy now? Ew. You look good. Don't lie to us, okay? Was this the only job available? Well, since you won't hire me at your place, and I didn't want to be a dog walker, this was the only one who would hire me right away. Well, it's a good job and not far from home. Ugh. I'd like a coffee now, please. Are you planning to come here every day? My coffee machine burned down to ashes as well. Yeah. As you keep reminding us, okay? So, I hate you. Not a nice way to treat a client. Well, you're not just any regular client, are you? But it's your first day here, so I understand. Is this really the first non-modeling job you've ever had? Okay, please stop taking pictures of us. Are you excited for the school trip to New York? Hell yeah, I am. I could use a little vacation. My new job sucks. Why is everyone staring at us? Stop staring at DuPont. Yeah, shoot your shot if you really like her. Yeah, well, he's with the crazy Holly. Or maybe don't. Molly will kill you. Oh, shut up. You all want her too. At least I have a plan, unlike you two. Please, anything with 
Sabrina, us, and you, and a plan, just cancel it. We don't, we don't want it. What plan? Sabrina's stupid boyfriend is obviously not coming because it's a school trip. Trust me, by the end of this trip, she'll be my girlfriend. <laughs> You're actually delusional to think that we would want you. Okay, all right, Chase, keep dreaming. It's just gonna end there like that, guys. Okay, so we're going on a school trip. Chase seems a little bit psycho to me. Like, I don't know what he's planning to do, but we don't like you. Take a hint, buddy. But we kissed Scott. Guys, he likes us. We like him. It's just, it's bound to happen. But that was the video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of this episode. But I love y'all. Don't forget to love yourself. Until next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace out, scouts. Bye.